Hello, Dontron. Oh, uh, Leo. Yeah, just uh, sit there for a while. I'll tell you when I'm ready. Alrighty, yo. So, um, what are you working on? Before I answer that, I want to ask you something. Uh, okay. Donnie, what happened up there? When you were fighting the Krang? Up on the ship? On your own? What made you do what you did? Well, I was trying to trap the Krang. Just like we planned. <laughs> what, does that big brain of yours not remember? The plan was to stop the Krang. Not to stop you. <laughs> well, there was no other option, Don. No, there were other options. Many options, probably. We could have thought of something, you know, together, like the team we are. We didn't have time to think of a plan. If I didn't get him in that portal at that moment, who knows what he could have done? It doesn't matter, Leo. Why are you so upset? Where did this even come from? Oh. oh. I see what this is. You didn't need help with anything, did you? No. You just called me over to rant about how mad you are at me. Leo. Well, I personally have better things to be doing right now. And uh, honestly, I've made worse mistakes. You'll just have to add that to the pile. I don't know. Maybe you can roast me at dinner time. You know, at least then I'll have a pizza in my hand when you do it. Oh, Donald. The door. Why did you throw yourself in the prison dimension? I just told you why. No, Leo. You're using the Krang as an excuse. You were so quick to do it. You were so unhesitant to throw yourself in that situation. Donnie, this isn't funny anymore. What Open the were door. You thinking, Leo. Did you just not care? Donnie, were you not thinking about how much that would affect us? Hey, I did that to protect us. To protect you, to protect our family. Because that's what I'm supposed to do. What you're supposed to do is stop being such a self-centered prick. Look, I don't have the patience for this. Open the door. Even now, you insist on doing things your own way. Not once thinking about your surroundings or the people you affect. Did you even at any point think about how Raph would respond to you throwing yourself into a possible death trap? Or Mikey? Or April? Or Dad? Or well, Tommy, me? Just stop it already! Or what? You'll do something reckless again because as far as i know you love doing that so much open the door you just go in all other options out the window it's like you want it to happen like you want to kill yourself what wait leo okay you tony you want to have this talk fine we'll have this talk Wait. Let's have this talk about Leonardo Hamato, the face man, the narcissist, and surprise, the fuck up. The one that does nothing productive to the team. The one that makes jokes that are so awful that his brother had to make a shock collar just to shut him up. Leo. The one that was elected leader even though everyone, including himself, knows that Raph would be way better than he will ever be. Leo, The no. one that hated himself so much that he would be so brave to throw himself into another dimension and get beaten up by an alien as a way to off himself without doing it on his own like a real man. But hey. Since we're here, why don't we talk about everyone else, yeah? What about Raph? The oldest, the burly brawn, the mother hen. The one that keeps all of his problems from everyone and pretends nothing is wrong. What? Or Mikey, the youngest, the cutest, the golden child. The one that hides his fears in his cooking and art and pretends like his issues aren't important. Stop. <laughs> stop? Why stop now? We're getting to the best part. You know him, you love him. The one and only Donatello. The brainiac, the funny one, the one that suddenly started falling in love with hoodies. But in reality, he's locking himself in his lab, cutting himself until he passes out. How? How do you- Open the door, Dottie. Let's do each other a favor, yeah? 
You stay out of my business, and I stay out of yours.